going to talk about standard operating procedures. They are part of the lab master documentation system. They are an essential part of every laboratory because they do cover all activities. They cover the administration, the personnel management, the safety, hygiene, the technical part. They must be written very well so as to be readable, clear, precise, practical. And they must be fully understood and followed. So it's a good thing to review your protocols and procedures with your personnel prior to them starting to work. And it is also directly connected to um, the qualifications of the personnel. Are they qualified to do what the protocols and the uh, procedures do cover? So the first thing we'll show you, everything in this laboratory here is all the protocols and procedures that we use are included in this, which is available to everyone at the entrance of the laboratory, and it covers every, every activity that happens here. Uh, another good thing about um, practical protocols and procedures, because people are going to be using them all day long as they do it so as to be to, to ensure repeatable results. Uh, some of our protocols and procedures have been plastified to allow use actually while you're doing the, the, the procedures. So this is one of the most critical document that you may have in the laboratory.